Fantastic feeling, man. I mean, it's like a relief now. I'm finally, finally doing good in the system. I feel real good. Uh, you're not running back like a idiot anymore, I guess. <laughs> not anymore, I guess. I mean, I fit in where I fit in. I just do what I have to do. It's been a while since we've uh, seen Utah fans rush the field like that. Yeah. How amazing does that feel? First time I've seen it, though, I mean, since I've been here the first time, is it gave me a lot of chills. Now I feel like crying. I finally, finally gave the city something they want to see. How did you guys keep believing? How did you do it this week? It's quite a turnaround. <laughs> I can't tell how we did. I mean, we just stuck with it, believed in our culture, believed in our team, just, just believed in everything, believed in the system. You guys, I mean, always thinking it's there for you to just get it to go. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I was here for three years, and I seen the system work, the offense work. It was just a matter of time until we started clicking, and we clicked tonight, and it's all what happened. What do you think about Jeff's 260? That's most since 1948. Oh, man. <laughs> Before I, your dad was born. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I would never imagine it. I would never thought of it. Like, when I committed here, I would never thought of getting 200 yards, even like more than. Like, the most I would imagine was getting 150. I mean, that's like a real good game when I got 260. Why well, was unbelievable? I mean, like, I'm trying to wake up. <laughs> What's next? 300? Is that? That's my next dog, I guess, right? I mean, the only way to go up, I'm gonna go up. 260? <laughs> nah, I didn't feel like 32 carries or 34 carries in front of 260. Played out. You know, on the sidelines, you guys were down 10 to 3. Houston's got the ball, second one on the six yard line. The defense made that stand. How much energy did that get the offense? I mean, everybody got excited. Everybody, the snapper, deep snapper, ST, everybody got excited. The walk ons, uh, red shirt, everybody, everybody was excited like we're still in the game we can still win it we can beat the number 12 team in the nation and we beat them is that when you started believing that it could be done no, I believed in the locker room. Uh, Russell Clark gave a real, real good motivational speech. Uh, his grandma was out here. He wanted to play for his grandmother. Uh, she's going through a tough time right now. So I kind of dedicated the game to make her happy, to see us win, to see uh, Russell Clark succeed and win a game here while she's here. For her first game here watching us play. I want to show us how we could play. Awesome. What's up, man? Nice work. Thank you, though.